to show you how to create um, class groups and to look at attendance uh, a little bit easier if you have multiple sections of a course in the same uh, same class period. All right, so if you look at my attendance, for example, you can see that for first period, I have two sections. I have a C401 and a C402. And for attendance, I don't want to have to go to two different screens to see or to take attendance for those those classes. So in order to fix that, what I want to do is I want to select by class, or excuse me, I want to select by period, and then I want to do current class. And what that'll do is it'll group all of my students together by the class period for the current day. And so that helps fix that issue in the, on the uh, attendance side. Now in Gradebook, what we want to do is create a class group. And so we'll go to the menu button, we'll go to Gradebook and Class Groups. And at first this is going to be blank, but if I go over to the right side of the screen and click Add Class Group and name it, so I'm going to call this uh, C4L, and find the sections I want to add to it, and I want to add all my sections. and then click Save. Now from here if I will go over to Class List by clicking Class List on the right side it's going to pull up all my classes. You notice I have now one larger class group as all the group classes grouped together. Now if I want this to be a, um, a shortcut on my, my desktop, a tile, all I have to do is select the group, click on More, and add gray sheet tile to desktop. And once I do that and go home, I now have one named Grade Sheet. And just to make it easier for me to see, I'm going to go ahead and edit it. Change this to C4L Gradebook. And then I've already changed the color to purple. It makes it a little easier for me to see. So I'm going to save and back. As you can see, now it says C4L Gradebook. And a little bit easier for me to find. So I hope this can help and uh, I'll have some more videos on cumulative coming your way soon enough.